three vans in total. Three. Billy, you're not listening to me. But just tell me exactly how many deliveries actually turned up. Morning. Morning. Billy, stop talking. I'll be over in a bit. I spoke to the fitters and they're going to be at the club at three with a new sign. Where'd you get the suit? Oh, from that wedding last year. What? Just look. Handsome. You know this is a one-day thing, right? Work experience. As soon as we're up and running properly, you can help out evenings and weekends, but that's it. You know what date you say, don't you? Hello? <clears throat> Jack? Hi. You are aware your front door's been left wide open. Billy. So what, the old sign down for day, is it? Yeah. And we've got three vans worth of stock arriving. Well, listen, if you need an extra pair of vans. That'll be fine. great. Would you want to get dressed? Uh, yeah. Another inset date today, then? No. Anniversary of my dad's death. All set? Let the phoenix rise. Don't say that again. Billy just dropped another case of champagne. I don't know why you're paying him and you can employ me. And why is Desperate Dan here? Look, Jack used to run this place. He's got plenty of money and time on his hands. Yeah, and he's on you. Look. We've got a lot to get through today, so either be a part of it or go back to school. She tied in this room, didn't she? Hunter. <sighs> Must be a tough day for him. He mentioned something earlier. What, he talked to you? He talks a bit strong, but... But maybe I should have a word with him. No, properly, man to man. Yeah. Good luck with that. This is my... Right. I'm just going to sign for all of this. Right. So, how are you settling in? New school. New one. You're really going to do this? Small talk. <laughs> you remind me of my brother. Your dad would be proud of you. You know, helping your mum out like this. Yeah. You used to run this place. Yeah, I know. So not happen then. Yeah, some people do things. And when they get caught up in things, things they wouldn't normally. I mean, look at my brother. Is he perfect? No. But does that make him a terrible person? Your dad did what he did. But that's not all your dad did. What do you know about it? I know what it's like to lose someone. I lost my mum, I lost my dad. I lost my wife. You know, she used to work in this place. Yeah? What was her name? Ronnie. Do you know what someone said to me once? Grief is like this. Stone. First, it's heavy, it's overbearing. It weighs you down. And you don't think you're ever going to be able to shake it off. But over time, you know, it wears down. It becomes lighter. And that stone's a stone you carry around in your pocket. A reminder of the person you lost. <laughs> Read that in a book, did you? Yeah, well... I don't even have a stone, do I? I didn't know my dad. You got this place. This is how you know him. Coming in. Stop hanging the movie, so is it? <laughs> 